Hello my friends, welcome back in my channel. My name is Miro Vrlik and I'm photographer and videographer. I am concentrating work with stock agency around the world and I want to tell you today about five things which can help you improve your stock photography or video photography business and maybe can improve your sales with stock agency over around the the world have a great time with watching and so this will help you with your next video or with your next photography project i will start with number one and number one for me it's concentrating on less saturday saturated object and try find something new what is not really common and doesn't matter if we talk about object or about the location or place i really last couple of years i tried to do something what i never did before like a photographer and i must say it looks like it's working because some my video and or photography it's, it's really not too much covered with stack agency and this is really the key how you can make more sales i know it's very hard to find something new but trust me many many new stuff it's around you because you see every day just you never take the picture of that or video you you really never look at some stuff around you like like uh, like your object for photography or videography if you want shoot with a video or with photography something what is really well covered on the market must be really really very good and much better than anything what is already online but trust me it's definitely not so easy because it's almost every common object it's very very well covered on the market it was not easy find something new but trust me it is possible just open your eye and think about that before you start any other project number two for me it's definitely find some new angle or a different composition this is definitely very very strong tools if you find some new angle and you will try to do it something what is not easy to do or sometimes it's very easy but it's not not too much images or video with this angle on the market trust me this will sell for sure because everybody is looking for something new for something of what is let's say unusual but everybody knows what is the object everybody knows what is what is it just it's like something different you can see couple stuff on my video what is really done from different angle and i think it's interesting i can be wrong i will let you know because someone it's on the market really just couple days but i will update in my monthly stack sales information and you will see if this video it's or picture it's sold or not in future number three for me it's homework especially i'm talking about when i travel somewhere to new location i always go to google and i try find anything possible over the uh, about the location i try found really what interesting is around and not just in the location but i'm always checking couple mile let's say 20 mile plus minus in this the circle because i don't want to miss something when i'm there and i prefer to travel 20 minutes or half hour to some new place then come home from from trip and find out or, or later online what, what i already miss this means homework is very very important and many times i do my homework even on the location because mostly i try shoot the photography or video um, evening or morning and during the day i try enjoy the place 
and do some research what I can shoot next day, what will be interesting with better lights than middle day, and I think it's, it's, it's worth it. And it was bringing the return to you later. For number four, what is really important for me, it's, it's editing. You are already home, you are you have your picture download in computer and video and it's time to edit. My personal thing is don't do too much. Don't over edit because less is sometimes more and you, you don't know what somebody, how somebody want to use the picture. I really many times don't do too much, like also too much cropping and, and definitely I try be away, stay away from heavy editing because let it do somebody who buy the video, the, the work, because he know how you want to use the video or the, the photography. Mostly I do just really very light editing, some contrast, a little bit with moving the levels, but absolutely no, nothing, nothing crazy, not, not heavy sharpening or something like that, because this can the, this can destroy the picture and the picture can be worse or video than when you start. Number five for me, what I think is really very important thing is it's keywording. Keywording is something what is very powerful and this is the things what make your picture saleable or not because the better keywords, the better sell. You can you can trust me on this one, and I really try to put, put inside the most keywords about the location where I am. I will always say if it's day or night or evening. I will say where I am exactly. If it's in East Coast, West Coast, if it's in Europe or any other part of the earth, and. Always I try to find some common names because many locations have common name with, you know, with some place. And I also search on Google and I try to find the most information about, about anything what is, what is on my picture or on my video. Same if I do some photography with some products, I always try to find the most information if it's plant, or, or something flowers I try found the most common name I try found the, the Latin name and and when, when it's come from it's, it's really very important for some people and and me, many people is using for searching word you maybe never hear the word and it, this is really good if you check the Google and I you and you will find something what is what is really important about the, the, your object. You will see and find out by yourself what to do, but for you will be, this will be your wasting time because it's better if you learn from someone who knows and you don't have to waste time with finding out by yourself. Sometimes it's really much better when you try skip the mistake what other people did before because this can move you forward much faster. Thank you very much for watching and I really appreciate you following my channel and please if you like this video click on the like if you have any question let me know I will try to respond to anybody if I know the answer and I hope so I will see you soon in my channel again in next episode. Thank you very much and have a wonderful time.